Good morning. My name is Julie and I am on a filthy, dirty, just atrocious low carb journey. And I don't want to get my hopes up too high, but here we are one week after my second dose of the COVID vaccine, specifically Moderna. And I think we've taken a turn, a good turn positive turn. We might have turned a corner. Um, it has been the most hellish wasted week probably of my life. And this is keeping in mind that I've had 10 surgeries. <laughs> Some of them major, major surgeries, taking out organs and putting other organs back together. So, um, <laughs> and this has absolutely been more miserable than any of those. Why? Well, for the headache. That has been absolutely the worst part. I mean, there's been a bazillion other miserable symptoms, but the headache, very literally, without my usual drama and flair, because it's not needed in this case, uh, the worst headache of my life, especially in the morning and at night. I'm not saying the headache is completely gone because it's not, but it's now like a regular kind of miserable. Not a, please God, just let me die. Yes, I'm agnostic and I'm even saying that. That's how bad the headache has been. Good night, nurse. Yeah, I've had some very, very dark moments. Um, I know I'm looking a little gaunt, but I think that's just part of the side effects of it all. I haven't lost any weight, which brings me back to the keto part. Oh, my nutrition <laughs> has not it's just not not been not no no there will be or there have been whole days where I've barely eaten anything at all because I just couldn't stand it or or the pain just from chewing or even having yogurt too much and I could not eat uh, you know that's a bad thing when me I am not able to eat. <laughs> it's not good. And then, of course, other days where I've made up for that. So, no, I've been all over the place. Just all over the place. <laughs> but today is a new day. And wonderful thing, and this is how I, I knew. Well, two ways that I knew um, that there was a good chance, without getting my hopes up too high, but a good chance that we were turning a corner. One... When I woke up, I didn't immediately feel like my head was going to explode, which has been the case every morning since getting the shot, the second shot. Um, but then after that, I was able to drink some coffee. And if you know me at all from watching our other bigger channels, our main channels, uh, and even just on here, you'll know that my coffee, it's... <sighs> We have a relationship, a beautiful relationship, and I thought we were going to be broken up forever at this point because I couldn't have coffee. Oh, the hell, between that and the just exploding headache, oh, I can handle the body aches, the fever, the chills, but the nausea that kept me from my coffee and, and the, like alien about to burst out of your head kind of headache. Those are what has been the worst. I even can handle the mouth sores all over inside my upper lip. Um, not sure if I've mentioned those anywhere on any of our other channels or not, but um, yeah, <laughs> mouth sores all over here. <laughs> I had no idea that was going to be a side effect, but yeah, mouth sores. Um, I, I can handle all of that, all of it. Idiot drivers that just stop their cars in the middle of the road is what we've got right here in front of me. Jackasses. Um, huh, I can handle all of that. But not that you want to kill people kind of headaches and then jump gloriously off of a bridge into sweet oblivion. Um, yeah, that and, and the nausea that has prevented me from having coffee. All of that to say, I was able to have coffee. 
I was able to have coffee. Oh, <laughs> glory be, I could have coffee. Jeez. <laughs> Just, I had coffee. You don't know, guys, what is going to matter and what you're going to miss um, until you can't have it. And then, oh, sorry, I park here and it is horrible for recording. But if I don't get this recorded now, I'm not going to do it. Oh, yeah. Coffee. A sign of hope in a sea of darkness. Yes, I am a creative writing major, okay? So you're going to hear lots of words and poetry as I awake from this week's just madness. <sighs> I've got a live stream to get ready for on the main channel. Hey, there I am on the main channel, the frugal family. And uh, I'm back on track. I'm taking it easy. I'm taking it slow. Promised my daughter that we're not jumping back in all, you know, gung ho. There are plants I want to dig up and move. There's trees that need chopping and topiaries that need trimming and a house that needs cleaning. But I'm not going to do my usual, which is, oh, you feel a teeny tiny bit better. Let's go gung ho. Nope. I'm not doing it. That's a promise. <sighs> yeah. But I do feel alive again and that's beautiful word to the wise whether you choose to get a vaccine or not i don't want to hear about it okay um i mean i don't mean that rude but when i say i don't want to hear about it i don't want to hear everyone's stance on why you shouldn't do this and why you shouldn't do that and all that anti-vax stuff and nonsense i don't want to hear it save that for somewhere else please <laughs> save that for somewhere else it's not helpful here but what i am going to say is if you do decide to get it please for the love of god get the johnson and johnson i know oh this problem and that problem stop if you've ever taken birth control then i don't want to hear about blood clots and nonsense okay um please keep that to yourself if you're against the vaccine go talk about it in some anti-vax space, not here, okay? Um, but if you do choose to get it, go with Johnson & Johnson because the second dose is always worse. And with the, always, for people that are gonna have a bad time of it, the second dose is worse. Note that, for people that are going to have a bad response, the second dose is worse. With Johnson & Johnson, you don't have to get two doses. Please hear me from this week of misery. Just get the single dose. Save yourself a week of your life. Anyway, okay, that's all. Gotta go get the other kids ready and on their way. And yeah, then get ready for my live stream. Okay? Okay. Thanks for being patient with me. Bye, bye, bye.